I believe all of us who believe in humanity and human rights and the rule of law have a duty to support the movement for freedom in Zimbabwe. I want to see free and fair elections because in the end the people of Zimbabwe will choose their free and democratically elected government. So I'm delighted to see Trudy here today who has fought with such courage in Harare. I pay tribute to her. I pay tribute to the MDC. In this country there are many people who support you. We will continue to give you our support and we wish you every luck. What I'd like to do now is to start this, uh, this march. I'm told I'm going to press a button which um, it normally brings fire engines running. I hope on this occasion it will merely start you walking. Well done and good luck to you all. Is the respect centre going to work to the MDC or to all parties? Because the escalating of violence is not only on behalf of MDC, but we've got so many political parties, Liberty Party, and all these other political parties. Indeed, the Respite Centre is open to any victim of violence who has been participating in the struggle for democracy, in the struggle for change. So it's not only even MDC, it's also civil society. The NCA, the trade unions, the churches, um, the crisis uh, centre, the women's coalition, all of the everybody any individual can be a victim of